Women in Ireland have never had it better. Or so they say, see, our great nation was built on courage and resilience, modelled after the builders and the fixers, the kind of women who fought with home-cooked meals and needle and thread, the kind that lined the streets so that they could fight with a voting ballot, the ones who refused to accept that their story stops here. You see, women like this do not exist in fairy tales. The women who are known as washroom warriors, whose compliments slur like spilled vodka, regret washed down with spiced rum, table top teas, liquor laced lips, the women who fight with their right to party, the women who ad lib anthems like absolute animals, the women who sister foreign sororities, but will still side you tissue from the neighboring cubicle. They're lipstick warriors, armed and bred for battle, matriarchy crowned with bend and snap. They are the women who spread legs at will to interview suitors the first test is the ability to satiate, discarding those who fail at crumpled tissues, the women who worship God at the feet of their own bodies, a temple built on consent and self-employment, a harmony of soft moans and squeals like a siren song, a haunting design by deity. They own every hair and stretch mark the eye can see and flaunt them tenaciously because this is what beauty looks like. These are the quiet women, the loud women, the women who are all tongue-tied and mute with thought, the ones who stumble over syllables and soliloquies, excitement spilling their voices, the women who give all of themselves, the women who give none of themselves, they are not defined by what was or what should be. Women like this are protest and movement and march and repeal, justice engraved in their skin, the women lined up outside with picket and post, demanding for their voices to not be heard but listened to. To be a woman in Ireland is to be a fighter, a warrior, a hero. It is to belong to a sisterhood of unimaginable potential. Women like this do not need to exist in fairy tales. They are the magic of a beating heart.